Hi, my name is Mike and this is a poem I wrote called Always With Me. My social life you decimate, my relationships you dominate, I'm an inmate, trapped, unable to operate, you debilitate my life, you intoxicate, you humiliate, I'm starting to asphyxiate, you strangulate, my life you assassinate, my happiness you confiscate, you mutate, then incarcerate. I'm unable to perforate the veil you use to incubate, to fuel the hate, to contaminate those who wish me to rejuvenate. You make me stagnate. I can't concentrate. My thoughts unable to formulate. My mind is now a police state that you dictate. I wish I could articulate how it is you make me segregate. You make me desolate. You keep me separate. You stop me when I try to communicate. I'm desperate. You make me deteriorate. I need to re-educate, to circumnavigate the mind you chose to desecrate. I try to retaliate. I medicate, have therapy to rehabilitate. Let doctors investigate, interrogate in the hopes one day I can obliterate. Try to mitigate the damage that you create. I'm scared that you'll escalate. So I'll remain your subordinate. Step back in line and cooperate because I know you'll not hesitate to terminate. Here's the reality. Depression's on a killing spree. Yearly UK deaths, 6,050. Are you kidding me? We need a new strategy rapidly to fight this disability. Hear my plea. Check in with your family before they break mentally, pushing them to finality. We're not just unhappy, we're in agony. But unlike a cavity you cannot see, understandably, it's our mind with the atrophy. Our brain acts irrationally pushes us to solidarity, makes us anxiously act callously to break our sanity. Let's think critically, practically. This disease runs internationally, does not care for your sexuality, your morality, where you are financially, your spirituality. Yet we lackadaisically, casually, remove validity from those who struggle daily. I hope you understand the brutality, because I'll never be free. Depression will always be with me. Thank you.